Well, hello, Cancer. Today we're going to do the March 2021 Twin Flame forecast. Okay, so we're going to have used the tarot cards. We're going to use the angel deck as well. And at the end of this video, we're going to ask a yes or no question in, re in regards to March and love. So start thinking about your yes or no question and stick around till the end. Okay? All right, so let's do a little shuffle, even though I already did a shuffle, but so you can see I'm shuffling. This material is pretty hard to shuffle, as you can see, it's green. I got it set for all March. March, we got the spring equinox. Green is for growth. <laughs> okay, I think we're done here. All right, this stack is for you, Cancer, and this one's for your twin flame. Okay, let's put it together. Alright. Let's pick two of these and see how that goes. Okay. Okay, so I want to start off with how you see your partner or your twin flame, how you see yourself currently, how they see you how you see your how they see themselves okay hmm interesting already we're already getting a lot here okay all right cancer so hmm there seems to be something going on with them in terms of transitioning moving on with them okay like they moved on or something or maybe they broke up and they just wanted another relationship but this is something that you see with them like they've transitioned they've disappeared moved on how they see you they see you heartbroken i feel like for some reason they broke your heart but it's funny because it doesn't seem like that on your side you have here the sun unless you're feeling delusional and you're feeling like this person's still with you unless that's the case i'm just you know putting my input here you're gonna have to tailor this reading to your own situation but we have here that they see you like you're heartbroken like there's been a separation a third party something that you know made you sad or depressed and they see themselves like really negative about this okay like you know they did something they, they feel crushed okay so something happened there was a very big discord and you see this person like they've moved on okay basically that's what i see here um let's see the main theme here on your side and the main theme on their side okay interesting enough we have here two cards in regards to aries hmm. we have the emperor and we have the two of wands and it's all about dominion and who has the last word who's the one that decides things in this relationship so maybe that's what happened here maybe you guys were too you know domineering ele elements here in terms of who gets you know to decide okay and that's probably what crushed the you know what crushed you guys okay so let's see what happens let's see the energy is getting ready to evolve on your side for march energy is getting ready to evolve on their side Actions you'll be taking towards them, okay. Um, actions they'll be taking towards you, and as a result, okay, interesting. All right, so energy's getting ready to evolve on your side. You really want to settle down, Cancer. We have here the Ten of Cups. You really want to settle down with a family, enjoy life, fulfill, being radiating. This is what you want. This is energy's getting to, getting ready to take place. So maybe you're thinking of making peace with this person. We're contacting this person because you really want this harmony again, okay? And on their side, we have here victory. We have here the seven of, of wands. Victory is like a good news thing. Like, energy is evolving on their side. They want to hear good news, okay? Maybe they want you to call them. Maybe they want you to reach out. They want to hear that good news, okay? This energy getting ready to evolve on their side, okay? Actions you'll be taking towards this person. We have here the nine of cups, okay? fulfilling a wish interesting so the energies that you're going to be um, emanating to this person in march is all about happiness a smile on your face coming up with a very positive energy perhaps you know it ended wrong between you guys but now you are bringing this positive energy for march okay on their side we have here energies evolving that sorry energies will be taken towards you we have here the chariot interesting hmm a new path, a new idea, a new way of doing things. 
Maybe they're thinking of doing things a different way this time, Cancer. Maybe they're thinking of improving themselves if they're the ones that did wrong. Okay, um, but there's definitely a new promise here, a new, you know, new beginning. And, you know, the chariot actually rules Cancer, by the way. Okay. And as a result, we have a transformation, a very, very, very big transformation. Okay, we have death. Interesting. I want to know how you feel about that. The tower and we on their side the high priestess okay we're gonna have to rely on the other cards to see what this means because the way you feel about this we have here the tower like ripped apart but this doesn't have to be a negative card this could be a very positive card as well this could mean like changing your insides changing everything about you inside your ego everything gets transformed as well okay and how you will feel about this major transformation and on their side they have the high priestess meaning they will be independent okay um perhaps go their own way but we have to see the rest of the cards okay because this is un pretty unclear to me okay deception hmm and it's on your side someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship okay and on their side give your relationship a second chance okay so I feel like perhaps you cancer are the one reaching out for this person maybe you deceived this person because they feel like crushed Okay, and you see them moving on, but you're like, mm, could you have done a three-way on this person? And they see you like three-way, like, you know, you've broke their heart or whatever. Um, but this is asking them to give their relationship another chance. Perhaps they don't want to. Hmm, work on your partnership. Hmm, so you're pretty much asking this person to come back. And there's going to be a really, really major transformation that perhaps... I mean, there's a new path for this person. They want to hear the good news. But for some reason, you guys don't meet in the middle ground. You can't make it work because you you feel crushed. You're like, wow, this person didn't take me back. And they feel like they got to go on their own way. They're, they're independent from this relationship. Hmm. So that's what I get. This is the picture that I get for March. A major, major transformation cancer. That perhaps, you know, this person didn't accept everything that happened. Okay. All right. So let's ask a yes or no question. And let's see what we could get. Ask a friend. Okay. So maybe in regards to the situation, you might need the help of friends to lead you and give you some advice. Okay. Alright guys, so if you enjoyed this reading, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, share, and comment below. Let me know what you think, what's going on. I'd love to hear your story, guys. Okay. Alright guys, so I see you next time. Bye.